all these three units be, belong to infection kind of unit. Firstly, we're talking about measles. So measles in Chinese name, the word we call margin. So we can see the picture here. The patients have a lot of skin rash, can be on the face, can be on the body part. So that's coming from the missiles. So this is some basic idea here. Then we're talking about what is missiles? Missiles is a acute infection kind of illness. It is caused by measles virus. So it is a virus kind of infection unit. So we're talking about the early infection kind of unit, the common one, why is the virus? Another is the bacteria. But measles is a virus infection. So when patients have measles, some key symptoms and maybe cough, and maybe tearing, and nose congestion, and have some running nose. So if we just stop here, just like a generally common cold symptom. But they are not only, yeah, they are not, not only. They will have some special kind of symptom. Some spot inside the mouth on the mucosa. So the picture here is not that clear, but generally say it's kind of a white color on the inside mouth mucosa there. So that's found by some doctors and then named by his name. That's a special kind of symptom there. In other words, if children get a common cold, then you find inside the mouth mucosa there. They have some spot in there. That's a pretty also coming from measles. Generally coming cold will not cause that kind of a spot there. And the skin rash. So like we see the picture, a skin rash can go to all over the body. It's kind of red color, kind of skin rash. So that's generally say the measles. The measles. So for TCM, yeah, for virus medicine, we say that's virus infections. For TCM, uh, we, we say that's still external passengers, still belong to EPI, external passenger. It is evading internally, evading the lung and the spleen, because the lung and the spleen. They are pretty weak for the children. And uh, then they will go to like uh, 
internally originally body qi diversity, zheng qi diversity, and couldn't stronger enough fighting with the passengers. So then cause this kind of condition. So that's for TGM etiology. Yeah, TGM etiology. Yeah. I think maybe today some idea. Maybe in the cloud, some internet connection problem. Yeah, some students coming like a delay. Yeah, we just start. Yeah, we just start. Infection yield is the first one we talk about the missile. Yeah. So missiles, uh, the ionies, they have their special kind of stage, like the ionies development. So they will have like a initial stage, beginning stage. Then the ski rush coming up stage. Then recover stage. So that's basically for missiles. They are a little bit different with the other units. In different stage, they will have different symptoms. So then we then we talk about different patterns and the treatment. So we talk about beginning stage. So beginning stage, that's basically is the fever stage. That's basically is the passenger attacking the Wei Qi, Lang Wei. Wei Qi means Wei Qi, defending Qi. So that's the stage. So the symptoms in this stage, mainly is a fever cough. Slightly aversion to cold, or maybe aversion to wind. Nothing. No discharging. And maybe some sore and swollen sore. Maybe cause red eyes and the tears. And the photophobia. Photophobia, aversion to light. Yeah. Patient with light, the symptoms is worse. Don't look in for the light. And uh, maybe cry. So small children, they couldn't tell you. They couldn't tell you the symptoms. They just cry. And the poor appetite. Their fever, they may thirsty, they try to drink some water. Not enough body fluid, less urination. So like we talked about before, different stop here. Just the common cold symptoms. Just the common cold symptoms. But, yeah, but it's a kind of different. Start from second day or third day of a patient fever. Then we say special inside the mouth, mucosa air, can see some red spot in there. A kind of red 
red color and around with red around it. So that's a special symptom for this illness. Otherwise, the other symptom, just like a common cold. So tongue is let be right there, and a slightly thin yellow coating there. The pulse is floating, rapid pulse. So generally say in this stage, mainly is EDI, wind, Heat attack. We are now the specialists say wind heat, wind cold. We did say passenger heat attack in the lung. Specially on superficial of the body, that's way thin. So that's in the initial stage or beginning stage, the symptom. And the treatment principles do the same, like we treat for common cold. I feel the passenger wind, and uh, if we have some heat there, we need to clear heat. So the points. So we say this illness, yeah, this illness, truly acupuncture can help. Especially working, like a patient health fever, can reduce the degree of the fever, so bring down the fever. So that's truly with working. So we say this illness will have skin rash coming out. Before skin rash coming out, basically in the first stage, no skin rash show up. So in this stage, we use the points pretty similar, like we talked about the common cold. Yeah, common cold. I for combination is lung seven and uh, Sanjiao five. Uh, even you can add in like a gallbladder twenty, so that uh, we treat common cold symptom. And uh, for children, we talking about the uh, children's organ always weaker. Yeah, always weaker. So that's for children's condition, especially passenger attacking way tea level. We got some tea tonic that some of the safety. So some of the safety is a pretty good point. Tonic by Zheng Ti in PGM. But even for Western medicine, modern medicine, some people uh, especially do some studies about the points relationship, like a body is constitution and the relationship is our immunity system. So they they do a test. They put needles on the stomach 36. Then they find the people's immunity system cells increase. So that means truly like improve people's immunity system function. It's not only in PCM, even modern research, they still find a pretty good help people uh, improve immunity system function. And if children have high fever, we can go to do 14, clear some heat. And also LI11, clear some heat. 
So that's uh, generalized in the beginning state. Yeah, beginning state. Rush didn't show up yet. Then we're talking about like a second stage. Truly some skin rush coming up. So in that stage, the passengers invading a little bit differently to the lung and the stomach. Still internal organ weaker for the children. So in this stage, so basically, fever still in there. And let it be slightly sweaty. It's a heat still in there. Heat pushing body fluid go up. So that's a little bit sweaty in there. And the red eyes we see charging still in there. And uh, sometimes still cough. So basically symptoms, generally symptoms still in there. And then especially skin rush, rushing up from the skin. And uh, changing from small and then spend all over. And the skin rushing changing from right color to dark red color. If you put your finger there, yeah, then we're talking about the right color. If you put the finger there, like the color disappear. So that kind of skin rash. The tongue is more red and the tongue coating is more yellow. And maybe some greasy. So we say heat pretty easily combination with dummy. And the rapid pulse but forceful means that's mainly excessive condition. So body gently fighting with the passenger seat in there. So that's some excessive pulse in there. And the treatment principle. So we still has held the passenger plus more heat in the MLA. And still in this time, we need like the skin rush totally coming out. So for the TTM, when we talk here about the treatment, we are not like Western medicine. Why is the medicine talking about like the virus infected in there? Then just cure it. Yeah, just cure it. Bacteria infection there, just cure it. Yeah. But we talking about like the passenger, go away. Yeah, go away. Even there some root, let it go away. So that's the rush there. Still, some passenger there. We like a skin rush, all the coming out, and then go away. So that's our TCM anyway. So we use acupuncture treatment. Uh, so mainly during this stage, mainly is the heat in there. So mainly we need a clear heat. So that's we still use two fourteen and LI11 clear heat. 
and uh, AI4, it originally used radio external passenger, we still can use, use it here, but we can combination with liver three together, help them to move. And another point on the two channel, two ten, yeah, two ten. That's a special points can like uh, reduce some skin rashes caused by diesel. So that's a special point. Then we can modify the from there. So patient have the condition like uh, the heat caused the uh, irritability. So that we can go to PTA, clear heat. And also we can go to PT3, clear heat. So that uh, we can go to there. Uh, PT8, we talk about that the fair points. We can use fair points to clear heat. PT3 is the water points. We can go to the water point to get a heat. So that's why we pick up these two points. We talked about other units we talked about before. Fever pretty easily cause the children's conversion. So we try to reduce the fever. If it truly cause the Conversion. So we can go to actual point, Shishin, top of the finger. Certainly the same option to the general point. But I believe for the children, general points, you need to try to find the, the location small finger there and also people can watch it. You are a little bit difficult to needle them. But the shi xie right on top of the finger, you are a little bit easy to needle it. But the same mark, the same mark. So that's for this stage, we still try clear heat and also help the skin rush coming out. So measles is the illness. They can healing itself. So then go to recover stage. Like uh, after we help the skin rash coming out, then patient will gradually, gradually recover. So during this stage, basically patients tea and in is defense. So long time, body junk chi fighting with partner chi. Now partner chi is go away, but body junk chi is damaged already. So during this stage, skin rash is totally like irrelevant, yeah, totally coming out. And then gradually, gradually, like a fever is reducing, yeah, like a body temperature, gradually go to normal. But generally symptoms in this time, people tired. And then they feel sleep, like during the, like a fever time, skin rushing time. That kind of skin is itchy. Yeah, it's itchy. Children always try to grab it. Yeah, so that's truly disturbing children for sleep. And uh, now, like uh, the skin rash is totally coming out, it's not that itchy anymore. Then children tired and then feel sleep. sleep. And the cough is better also. 
Arbitide is taken by her. And then skin rush gradually, gradually disappeared. But generally say they will leave in their skin rush area some pigment. As you can see, like a children got skin rush before. Not either. So tongue still dry and more dry. Yeah, and more dry. The pulse now is a different kind of pulse. Maybe still some heat there. Maybe still kind of rapid. But truly, heat is much better compared with the last part. So treatment pencil for this one, mainly we need a tonify tea and a nursing in. Because during this day, tea and in both damage. And if still have some passenger in there, we still continually clear the passenger. So treatment pencil for this line. We say summer for 36, Tony by Zheng Qi. And the spring six, Le Xing Yi. If still some heat in there, and the spin rush in there, we can go to LI 11 to help reducing the heat and reducing the skin rashing. So that's basically for the midst of our treatment. Uh, like right now, not many children have got midst of infection. That's just because we have pretty effective kind of vaccine and preventing means of the infection. Uh, so usually, we have three infection kind of units we can vaccine together. So like if we go back uh, like 50, 60, or even before that time, uh, we don't have effective kind of vaccine for the measles. Measles, this kind of severe kind of disorder. It may cause uh, some people or even cause some children die. So it is a contaminated kind of illness. So during that time, like uh, if sometimes the parents find some children that measles, if the symptom is not that severe, they will bring their children go to the sick children uh, home and then get some natural infection there. And because the symptom is not that severe, so still got a kind of measles infection, but later on, they will have like antibodies to against the measles, preventing for severe kind of infection. But truly, we have vaccine right now. So vaccine performs the similar action. We give small amount of virus for the children. And then cause their pretty small reaction break, but got the antibody. So that's basically. So right now, we say during the measles, like, uh, transmission epidemic time, try not to keep children away from the public area. So try not to go the infection. So for the, from the, like other children, when they go out in the And if patient, yeah, if patient, some children, 
like uh, they don't know, but they talking with some other patient. So in that kind of uh, situation, isolated and watching for these children about 21 days, three weeks. So that's the way say, when people touching some virus or maybe some bacteria, they may not directly go to sick or illness. They will have some time and then symptoms show up. But during that time, they still possible transmit for other people. So like right now, we're talking about the COVID-19 infection. Averaging time, like after people touching with some people with COVID-19 infection, averaging out the symptoms time is 14 days. So certainly some people got the symptoms earlier than 14 days. Occasionally, some people even longer than 14 days. So we just take the average time. So right now, we say isolated. Like if you're coming back from the board, and then you isolate 14 days. So that's the same idea. Because people got the virus infected, they are not immediately show up for symptoms. But truly, during that time, they are also transmitted to others. For the missiles, isolated for 21 days. So different virus cause different illness. The hiding day is different. The hiding day is different. So if children truly got some symptoms there, Try to get the diagnosis as soon as possible. Then we can isolate them with other people. Generally speaking, okay, generally speaking, uh, if the skin rash totally coming out already after five five days after skin rash totally coming out. Then they will not transmit the virus to other people. So that's generally we say isolated the children after five days, all the skin rash develops. It. Then they can play with the other children. But if the children with a severe kind of situation cause the pneumonia. We talk here about the pneumonia before. That's lung infection. Severe kind of case. These measles can cause lung infection. These kind of children means they carry various amount is more bigger. So these kind of children should be isolated 10 days after all the skin rash coming out. No any new, yeah, no any new coming in after 10 days. Then can play with other children or maybe go to skin bath. So that's we talking about prevention. One important part, vaccine. Another important part, Try not to go to some public place during that time. So this illness still commonly happens in the spring season. Yes, spring season. So like other EPI kind of illness, pretty easily happens in the spring season. So during that time, try not to go to public area. Uh, keep children in the home. And if find some symptoms, must be careful if there are measles infection or this chemical. So that's for this one. 
And then we talk about the nursing care. So nursing care, that's basically uh, children have the problem. We say keep the room ventilating. Yeah, open the window, like the fresh air go in, and keep a suitable temper temperature and the humidity in there. But be careful, be careful. If sometimes outside is too cold or too stronger wind, or even too stronger sunset, still be careful. Don't directly touching to the people. So that's basically children, they don't know cold or hot. They get whatever the room environment in there, they get stay in there. They didn't tell you. But we need to be careful, maintain the environment. So that's some take care there. And also give the children enough water. So that's another important part. Uh, people have fever. Always need more body fluid to support because they sweat a lot. So that's we need to give enough water. Give enough water. So that's like a, uh, like a job. Some people getting sick always say. Drink some warm water, yeah. Not cold water, not hot water. Warm water, yeah, like a body temperature kind of water. So that's basically uh, we need to give enough water to drink. And also for the food. Easy digestive food. Because during the sick time, internally, like a uh, middle gel kind of deficiency. All the body junkie go to superficial to fighting with the pathogen. So internally some deficiency. I think everybody has experience when you're getting sick, uh, even you got a common cold, you don't like to eat. So poor appetite. So that's uh, all of your body junkie go to superficial the body and the internal middle gel deficiency. So they will easily digest food. Still encourage children to eat something like uh, pony fry some junk tea. So where is junk tea coming from? Nutrition, the nutrition. So even children don't like to eat, they still like encouraging the children to eat, give some easy digestive food. Don't put too much sugar or too much salt or even spicy food for the children. Yeah, lighter flavor, but easy digestive. So candy is a pretty good one. Yeah, rice candy. Uh, cooking a little bit longer time, and then children easily for digestion. And we say the skin rash will go to the eyes, the passenger go to the eyes and maybe go to the nose, cause some discharge in there or even tear there. And the skin rash go to the skin. So that we need to keep all the air clear and skin. So that's basically for this. 